What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Charting Crypto. We're going to do another update on Miro from yesterday. We are seeing that retracement that we talked about. We're down to seven cents again, peaked out at nine, starting to retrace, testing that prior channel that we broke out of, trying to see if it's support. If the support holds, that's going to be where Miro absolutely goes parabolic. Market cap, 70 million, circulating supply, 999 million with a 1 billion max supply. All time high was nine hours ago. We're down 22% from that all time high. All time low is two months ago. Currently available on the following exchanges. Uh, quite a few of them right now. So KuCoin, BingX, BitMart, Maxi. So with that, let's get into the price prediction and technical analysis on Miro. All right, everyone, let's get into Miro. So we were calling for this retracement yesterday. It seems to be playing out. What we want to keep a very, very close eye on is this 786 that we're currently testing as support. If the 786 breaks, there's a good chance that we're heading back down into this channel and down to that 618 at around five cents even. Indicators right now on the four hour are actually extremely bearish. Look how fast you lost your bullish momentum right there. The last four, eight, 12 hours, we're about ready to cross over here, cross over from bullish to bearish. RSI is extremely overbought, starting to free fall right now. We got the 92 starting to, starting to deviate back down rather quickly, flashing red. And we got multiple sell signals here on the WTX. We got that super high sell signal here, and we're currently tailing down as well. So if we actually break below 65 on the WTX, that would verify that we're falling back into this channel because that would be an official lower low. Same with the RSI. If we fell below this previous low right here, that would verify a free fall back down into the channel. So right now, the 786 that we're currently on is your life support here at around 6665. Keep that. Keep that uh, price uh, in the back of your head, right there on a sticky note, slap it on your forehead, write it on the du dust on your screen. I don't care what you do, but 6.5 has to be the support that holds. If you break below 6.5, I think 5 cents is going to be the retracement point. And then we, from there, we can see a rocket out. Because if we retrace all the way back down to the 6.18, that would allow all these indicators to reset and allow us to accumulate the moon juice that we need to rally out of here. That would also still be bullish because as you can see, our prior low was back here in January 4th. And if we bounce off that 6.18, that's a higher low. So even though we could drop down there and bounce, we still maintain our bullish momentum. Crazy part is we could actually go all the way down to the 0.5 here at 4 cents and bounce, and it would still maintain its bullish structure. Um, but from where we're currently at, if we break below the 786, I would expect another 20, 25% drop back down to the 618 uh, back into this channel. So keep an eye on 65 and then it'd be six cents. And then inevitably five cents would be the bottom. I think the five cents is the lowest that Myro would go before we saw another run up like this. So keep an eye on it, guys. I don't think the retracement is done yet, but keep an eye on the 786 because we're currently riding it as support. Just indicators are a little too hot for me to be extremely bullish on it right now. Now I'm bullish on it long-term, of course, but in the short term, I think it just needs to cool down and see a slight pullback. So with that, none of this is financial advice. And if there's any coins you'd like me to chart, or if you'd just like to chat with me, you can contact me on any of my social media links. All those links are below in the description.